Well, howdy there, Internet people. It's Bo again. So today we are going to talk about marketing and rainbows and why you should probably expect to continue to see them and that it's not really going to go away despite a semi-organized push to, to make them go away. I had a question. Short version is, hey, with all of the pushback, why are so many companies going forward with it? It's math. It's capitalism. It's capitalism. Okay, so let's start with this. There was a survey conducted. It's called Accelerating Acceptance. Okay, Survey of 2,500 people who were not members of the LGBTQ plus community. 70% said that companies should show their support through advertising, sponsorship, and hiring practices. 70%. That's, that's pretty big. But aside from that, there's another reason. The estimation that I saw said 17 million people in the U.S. are LGBTQ+. Okay. That survey was of people who weren't. 70% of them are supportive. You know the 17 million are supportive. And they're worth about a trillion dollars. That's a lot of money changing hands over the course of a year, right? Companies want their share of it. It's capitalism. And if you are looking at building your brand, you're looking at building your company, who are you more interested in showing support for? The 17 million people who have a trillion dollars worth of economic activity, who have an immutable characteristic, something that isn't going to change. And if you back away from them, well, you may lose that customer forever. Because that characteristic, that's with them forever, right? So, you lose that customer forever. Or you might lose a customer who is currently upset about rainbows in, in on store shelves. But who realistically cannot remember why exactly they smashed their Keurig. Because they'll forget about it. Over time, they will forget about it. And they'll get that. They will get them back. But if they abandon a community, they may never get them back. And they're probably worth more. There are probably more people in the LGBTQ plus community than are in the demographic of people who will participate in trying to show these woke companies who's boss. It's just math. Um, It's no big secret. Again, these companies, some may actually be vaguely socially responsible, okay? But the overwhelming majority, companies are like countries. They don't have friends. They don't have interests. Rather than the, you know, just unbridled pursuit of power, which is what countries do on the foreign policy scene, it is the unbridled pursuit of profit. There's no big mystery here. The reason you see rainbows everywhere is because of, well, the right wing. Capitalism. Capitalism is a right wing thing. It, it, it pays to uh, to have rainbows up. So they're going to. And there's not enough people who are that vested in the culture wars to put a dent in it. 
yeah, I mean, Target may move some displays around in certain stores. But they're also, what, dumping $175,000 into the Pride celebration up in New York? The money is always in acceptance. It is more profitable to be a good person. It is more profitable to be accepting. You have a wider market. Anyway, it's just a thought. Y'all have a good day.